すげえ。ちょっと待って。Don't say a word. Are you good? Oh, my back. Oh, damn, my back. No. No, don't tell me. I don't you say it. Oh, damn, my back. Oh, that. Hmm. Wait, what are you doing here? Um, if anything, you know, we, uh, the computer is linked to your, um,、uh, vitals, right? You, you remember that as a precaution? Oh, right. So, um,、uh, I forgot about that. Okay, so what happened here? Huh? What, what are you talking about? Like, why are you on the floor and you look like you're in some real pain? Well, um, Nana, what happened? Well, what happened was, don't you say it. The same thing.、Um, oh, wait. It did say something was coming wrong with your back. And. and no. Eric, whatever you're thinking, get that out of your, your mind right now. That did not.、Uh, don't. <laughs> Please, princess, don't say it. Nana, did you? Pull us back out? Yes. <gasps> Wait. Where's the fucking. Sarah, if you don't stop laughing. I'm sorry. It's just. I mean it. Okay, okay. Well, I got a question. What is it? Who was giving? Who was receiving? Wait, what? What are you talking about? It, it, come on, Daddy. It, it, he blew your back out. I, I, I mean, of course he was just.、Uh, say, oh, 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 God. Oh, God. No, no, no. No. This is not at all what happened. Excuse me? Yeah, that is not at all what happened. Okay, explain. No, no, please, please explain. Because right now, I'm, I'm even more confused. Eric, we're in the training room. What, do you, what, what did you think we were doing? Wait, what? what? Yeah. We were training. Only thing is, he let his guard down. Of course, a big mistake when it comes to a hunt. And yeah, I got d r o p on him and I dropped his ass. Yep, I slammed him to the ground and it was. It was rough. Oh. That's what happened. Huh. Seriously, I thought you guys were、uh, going, going at it like two rats in a wool sock. No! I mean, granted, that is how it turned out when it came to you guys. Being it together the first time, isn't it? Just because we, uh, 
hit it up like that before does not mean uh, why are you hesitating? She sees that Nana's blushing. She's like, oh god, wait, you, ha you So that wasn't the first time you. No. In here? No. It wasn't. Well, if you'll excuse me, I am going to erase my memory. Probably bleach my brain a little bit. <sighs> yeah, that's that seems like a good idea. The last thing I need is <clears throat> Eric is not that serious. Dad, you don't seem to understand the potential trauma that is linked to knowing where your uh, legal guardians or parents did the, you know, you know did the, um, uh, the tango. Oh. So yeah. If you if you excuse me, I will forget that you have uh, used this room that me Shinso Koga May. And God knows how many others have used for training for your little oh God what what I, I, I'm going I'm going to need I'm going to need a, a, a something a black light what we going to need to know where to disaffect you animals. Oh yeah. Cause so help me God. If this if the black light turns on and this place is lit up like a damn Christmas tree, I'm going to take care of it. The only way I know how. How would you do that? I'm going to cut the problem off at the source. Here. What? Are you threatening to deprive you of your your uh, troublemaker? Your fire hose? Yeah. So, I'm going to go out and find Blacklight or a thousand. And I will research this place. And if I swear. May the gods have mercy on your genitals if it turns out I find anything that I deem is too much. I I don't I don't know what to say. If you're scared, I suggest you start cleaning before I get back. Harry leaves, and Izuku and Nana are also like, did our daughter really just threaten to castrate me? Yes. Yes, she did. So, um, how, how, is, how is your back? We need to clean this place. What? Do you really think it's that bad? 
allow me. He's just gonna just push his buttons and then he just notices. Wait, why are the lights changing? As oh, wait, why? Why is this turned to a black light? Just in case. Uh, wait, did did you install this? Well, yeah. Why? Wait, did, were you planning just for this to come a thing? Yes. When? Well, uh, the first time. What? Yeah, the first time, uh, uh, we ended up uh, in such a position. I I did plan on training others, and you, you know, at least having other people be here. So cleaning would be very very uh, logical. <laughs> oh my God! You you really? You really planned that far ahead? Wait, does that mean you planned on... Yes. In here? Yeah. Wait a minute. If I didn't... If we would've... Were we gonna... I don't know. Things happen. Uh, oh, you are so dirty. Uh, I'm sorry. No, no, no. It's no, no need to. Damn. I didn't think you planned this far ahead. I didn't. Oh my god, that means all those other times that we. Is that why you were in bed after? Yes. You were cleaning up the evidence. You were. You were sanitizing the crime scene. Wait. She's looking around like, huh. It's clean. Oh, yeah, we didn't do anything. You made sure this place was spotless, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, I, I really did. I, I could not risk anyone. You know. Well, tis our re traumatized Ari. Oh yeah, no, there's no there's no doubt in my mind. She she is completely uh she is very wary of coming back here. Especially wearing being just regular workout clothes. She she is not gonna be able to trust this, uh, the cleanliness of this again. Unless, unless what? Mm. You tell her about your preparations? Okay, that's a good point. Yeah, I could. Or uh, what? We stop using this uh, training ground. What? We're saying, yeah, bedroom for a reason. 
What? Come on, the bed softer anyway. And uh, besides, you did order that new headboard, didn't you? Keep it clean. Boy. Right. That's why you did. Good. Uh, now, it's time to make it feel more like home. But, but, uh, my, my back. Your back's going to be at least in your worries. I'm uh, lifting up Izuku as they float away. By the time Mary does get back and she does a thorough scan of the whole damn training grounds, she is relieved, but also like, Hmm. Where'd they go? Anywho, Izuku is pretty much wondering how did my life become so interesting? What what forces have brought me to this moment? Well, that's how I'm also curious. I am technically a pseudo clan leader. I've done a lot of wait. Forgot. Oh yeah, I am. Who I am, the only real issue is <laughs> I can't reach the other hunters for coming down here and causing up a disturbance. Unless, huh? Actually, I might have an idea that would work. But man, it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Mm -hmm. Zuko, what is it? Well, clan leader, I got a favor. That's cute. Favor? That's that's rare coming from you. But I'll try my best to. I can, I suppose. Well, you need? I need to... Uh, I need to uh, establish that Earth is mine. What? Yeah. He's a good, is this a joke? Because it is, it is not funny. I'm sorry, but it's, it's not a joke at all. I am dead serious. No, you are going to be just dead. You gotta remember, you are not the only one that hunts. Earth. You're not the only one who has their eyes on Earth. If people find out here a little. I know. People already don't like you because you're human. What do you think they're going to think? What do you think they're going to do? What do you think you're trying to get rid of one of the most fruitful hunting grounds? What do you the ones with the most potential? I know. I know. A family here. I have people I need to protect. I can't risk them getting hurt. And I can't risk the Yauja getting exposed. <laughs> Are you kidding? I mean, yeah, back in the day, maybe there was a problem whenever we, that we could get exposed. I mean, 
we probably would have just nuked it in the third place where we got spotted it. Hell, there's some of those that even came out just to participate in Halloween. What? Oh, yeah. Are you kidding? Halloween was one of the best times for us to actually go out in the open and uh, start peeping some targets. Uh, wow. Yeah. And now? <laughs> Seriously, with all the diverse people with the diverse features, do you really think anyone wants to give that up? We could walk out daylight right now. And everyone would just think, oh, they just have the same quirk. Fair thing. The only reason why we haven't exposed ourselves as you know, aliens, let alone let them know that, yeah, not only are you not alone, and now why do we have better guns than you? Because of how dangerous they are. What? You cannot be that stupid. <laughs> Seriously. Just imagine if we ran across an ICE user. We are cold-blooded. We prefer the most humid or at least warm hot climates. If it gets too cold for us, we start to lock up, freeze. That's part of the reason why we did have a place that, uh, well, we did have a place for, uh, young bloods to get blooded on Earth. Uh, yeah, that didn't end too well. But, all oh, the same. We would be screwed. Even that all my person. He can destroy a mountain with one punch. What do you think he can do to Yoja? Uh, but still, I really don't want to risk anyone getting hurt. Trust me. If anything, you just need to stay cool, not do anything stupid, make sure no one knows about us, the usual. Is there really nothing I can really do to persuade anyone? No, you would be starting a war. That was just with one clan. Multiple, hell, hell, even Yaja Prime probably, probably will just set out a contract on you for the Bert or Sirs. You think they would actually send the enforcers after me? You're damn right. You have no idea how fruitful Earth really is. If we pick one of the right targets, the one of the perfect targets, they're greater than any xenomorph. Hell, if we find the right ones and have them harvested, more xenomorphs. The sheer scope of prestige you could get. I mean, don't get me wrong. Xenomorphs are great. Trophies and everything, but you humans, especially the ones with quirks, uh, they, they will never let you go. They will not risk such a valuable resource. So, I, well, I just give up? Yes. There's nothing you can do. Nothing. 
nothing. So that's it. Yeah. Yeah. It's either I drop it and whatever, or I risk going to war with an entire race of people who helped me, so to speak. And just our, the Dark Blades would, wouldn't be able to help me. Well, that's, that's a lot to take in. Yeah. I tried my damn best to get to where I am now just for it. The thing is, they know how dangerous humans are. They know that we would be great prey to mount on their walls. What the plaques have said, what their powers were. <sighs> it's just that if I do this, I will have to do it. And it would not be with the full force of Earth on my side. You mean. If Earth knew about them and tried to stop it, they would rather destroy the planet and just find another hunting ground. Well, that's not exactly what Clay are said, but uh, well, you're a clan leader who couldn't you just in, I'm a pseudo clan leader. I'm not old enough yet. No one's gonna take me seriously. Ugh, all I can do is hope for the best when it comes to, to certain individuals. So you can't enforce no rules like they can only hunt villains or something? As much as I wish, I really do wish that would work. It's the thing, they don't care really who their prey is as long as it's considered a worthy opponent. As long as they're not bad bloods, they won't be like, damn. As long as they can defend themselves. That's right. Bad bloods don't care. And no problem killing unarmed women or children, the elderly, the sick. Yeah. Or at least I can just kill them and even make some money off of it. But still, it's the ones I choose. Heroes. And unsuspecting citizens who just so happen to have a strong quirk. I mean, granted, they are weak to the cold and whatever. What? Oh, yeah. I mean, they're reptilian for a reason. Of course, of course, they can't handle the cold too much. Really? Yeah, but. Have you not been paying attention to some of the things I told you about these guys? Well, oh my god. Well, though there are several who will happily go through cold tundras and frozen wastelands to go after a target, the thing is, their biology does not meld well when it comes to you know the cold i mean if anything it hinders them that's why you prefer more warm humid climates 
point, there was this one. Oh, I hear he was a beast. Really? Oh, yeah. Viking Predator. I can't remember its name, but either way, he was jacked. Hell, arms like three, he has gone. Well, wait, what? Yeah, you can just imagine, he was heavy. He had no problem fighting and hunting in the cold, slaughtering Vikings, and God knows what else. That's crazy. Yeah. I mean, there's also the same Goku Predator. At least that's what, what his title is. That's a my check. What do you mean? No. You see, he would uh, seek out samurai and challenge them to one on one combat. What? Oh, yeah, he saw the end of the samurai. He was there. Hmm. Yeah, you have no idea. I mean, think they also call him an Oni, considering and hell, his biomass was incredible. Hmm. Anything else? <clears throat> no, nothing really. Grand thanks is I can't stop anyone from hunting here. All I can do is protect who I can. What do you mean? Well, I can't interfere in hunts. That would be dishonorable. I can't hinder them. I can't take trophies or anything like that. That is taboo. That is... Ugh. I'd be a bad blood for real. And then me being a human... Who's undergone hybridization? It's not going to be a good look. There would be one hell of a price on my head. <laughs> yeah. Considering that I did take over technically a clan of bad bloods who are going through, you know, redemption. It's not so easy to have everyone confident in my abilities. Um, yeah, I understand. So, if anything, I'm just going to have no choice but do some research on bad bloods. Wait, what? Yeah. I'm just going to start killing bad bloods. At least the ones who can't be redeemed or skipped out on death. But isn't there are you, criteria to becoming an enforcer? Oh, there is. But we can also be bounty hunters. Oh, oh no, yeah. If anything, I'll download the database of known bad bloods. And hopefully, I can get enough either on my side or, at the very least, get rid of them. They're the only ones I can take care of and not face repercussions besides other bounty hunters. What do you mean? You see, since there are bounty hunters and bounties to be had, and Yaojas don't usually turn bad blood, sometimes not even on purpose. And sometimes you're in the wrong place at the wrong time, 
you kill someone else's bounty, there's at least two choices. The bounty hunter says, okay, let's share this bounty together, split it. Or <laughs> you fight for it. Does that mean to the death? Yes. Really, you know, uh, it really depends on the victor. I mean, heck, if I win, great. I might let him live. If I don't, he might let me live. It all depends. There's never a guarantee that I'm going to make him get out. Sucks, but them's the breaks. This is crazy. Oh, yeah, you're telling me. If sucks. I now have no damn choice. If anything, it's like we're going to be a clan of bounty hunters. Really? No other way? No. Which there was, though. At least I'm going to have some more trophies soon enough. Alright. Really? Time to get down to business. I'm going to start. I'm going to go hunting. What about school? want to drop out but you just I know I know what's more important make sure that everyone's safe make sure I got a license to do what I do already illegally besides at least going up against bad bloods I can love some steam for the situation so the leaves, not on us pretty much all. Oh. oh, this is gonna be a whole new lifestyle to get used to. Until she actually does have an idea. Carry on doing this. Come on. Right. Nana, you're you're here. Wait, so so you finally? No, no, I I do not forgive you for what you said. If anything, I haven't kicked your ass enough. Yeah, <sighs> but if anything, I. Might have an idea for you to at least redeem yourself in the public's eyes. What? Yeah. You're going to do something for me. And? Yeah. Worst come the worst. This will be your final. Chance of redemption, which you could die from. All depends. Um, explain. Well, me and Ezekiel. Oh God, what what was it? Was he got to do with it? We've been doing some research, and turns out that an awful one may not only be alive, but he is in the middle of something. Something that can be very devastating. What? No, 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 no. That, that one time was a fluke. It had to be. Like, no. That thing had 
been in plenty of quirks that only one person or quirk could do that. You gotta be kidding. I wish I was. So, you wanna be a hero? You know I do. I really, really do. Good. Because the worst case scenario, you're going to die like one. But the world will love you again. Uh, no. First things first, we're going to have to make some changes. Come on, you're going to the Heroes Association. What? Yeah. We need to talk to him. <laughs> What's wrong? Let's sit down. No, I'm just not finding any real bounties. Seriously? Yeah. So you're really... You're really a dead set on this, aren't you? Yep. Got no choice. You can't risk a war with the whole entire race, but at the very least, the Bad Bloods, which are few in numbers, luckily, a fair game. And since I am fully blooded at the very least, then I can keep the tech. I know a certain someone who would love to get her hands on it. Sorry, brother. It's okay, Scarface. I just... I'm just tired. <laughs> it's funny you say that as young as you are. Hey! Humans age differently compared to y'all. True. But you've been hibernized with them, so it should not be affecting you so much. Touche. I, I will admit, yeah, you, you are not wrong. Yeah. <sighs> What else can I really do? I need to protect my family, the planet. Yeah, I understand. You could try something that made it Earth look less appealing. What? Think about it. We, as Yauja, hell, you included, all things considered, love worthy prey. And humans are worthy prey for not only their quirks, but their intelligence and resourcefulness. Yeah. Think about it. What if you, uh, took away some of them factors? What? You know. What if you found a way to get rid of them quirks and make sure that they are not nearly as worthy as they used to be? Because before, yeah, we would show up, but not nearly as often as we do now. You're kidding. Nope. You want me to nerf my own race? Hey. You're the one that hates quirk people. I don't hate them. Oh, yes, you did. Right. I did. I'm not gonna lie. I did. But not anymore. They're not that bad. Okay. So, what then? 
It's going to be slurring these fucking beneath you bad bloods until you die. So we see much other options. Fair enough. Well, at very least, don't drop out of school. Huh? Oh, yeah. I, I, I know. Oh, yeah. She told me she was worried about you and told me the whole damn thing. Well, granted, clearly you're told us too. Us? Oh, yeah. We don't want you to give up on your dream of being a hero. Yeah, at least we want you to be able to do it legally as well as what you're doing now. You know? We care about you, Fedoria. Granted, I didn't know about you until after they came back for me. <sighs> but Oh, well, that's, that's in the past, if anything. We're brothers. And thanks to you, I redeemed myself and avenged my brothers. Our brothers. I, uh, owe you a lot. Oh, yeah, I know. Wish you had told me about the damn main scenes in beforehand. You know what? Yeah, that's fair. Not to mention that whatever his name was, his mate. Oh, oh yeah, that dang. Yeah, yeah, I, I forgot all about that. Seriously, she was all over me. Oh yeah, I know. No, no, that I buy. That's that was terrible. Hey, it's our culture. Yeah, I get that. To, for him to get cuffed like that and be okay with it? Oh, no, he did not be okay with it. What? Yeah, he could have fought you. But then and there, he just chose not to. Really? Yeah. Seriously, do you think Mel Yowger, as we are, want to get cuffed? Do, do you know how much that hurts our pride? Like, hell, there was this one girl, this woman, you know, who completely hold her whole clan. What? Yeah, she was a big bitch. Hey, I'm sorry. But I'm not gonna lie, she was a huge. She towers over us. Everyone in the clan, she towers over us. We'd be looking up at her. She'd be looking down on us. And she would smile. She would laugh. Was she really that good? <laughs> yeah, she is that good. What? Oh, yeah, she's still alive. Thing is, she's elusive as hell. She's a sadistic woman. Seriously, she challenged her clan leader and won. Well, that could just be because he's skilled. Oh, yeah, she's more than skilled. She allowed him to be fully decked out, weapons and armor and everything. She was barely wearing anything as far as weapons. I can't remember if she even used them. I think she just wailed on his ass. What? Yeah. And then she put see the dog and whole and every single one of the, her clan members. Wait, so why is she bad blood? Would she be cleanlier? No, no, that's what makes it even worse. She left them. What? Yeah, but she pretty much dogged everyone in her clan, including the clan leader. It's such a humiliating display. She walked out on them. He called them weaklings. So that wasn't even worth it. 
She did what? Yeah, they call her the lunatic. Heck, during her xenomorph hunt, one of the fucking craziest things she's done was not only did she kill all the armed soldiers, not only did she allow each and every one of the humans to get harvested that weren't armed, they killed more xenomorphs. What about her, her clan? Oh, then they died. Not too soon after they killed their xenomorphs, they still died. She just kept on killing. She was a real overachiever. Seriously, the only thing is, when it came to her, her ways of hunting, she was playing my games. She tried this one human to <clears throat> self deletion over what she did to him and his men. This woman sounds crazy. Here's the name Lunatic. Hell, let, let, let me show you her picture. See our face showing a full design? Yeah. Is that life size? Yeah. She's that tall. Uh, I, uh, Wow, I, well, yeah, no, right, he's like, wait a damn minute, are you, huh, wait, what, no, 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 that's not the type of man, just told you something that was horrifying, and you get stiffy, I mean, if I had a chance, I probably Oh, you dirty bastard. Hey, ain't nothing yet. Ain't nothing wrong with a little crazy. She would backhand you. She would pick you up and toss you aside like a rag doll. If you even get on her nerves, she will stab you. Right in front of your face and lift you up. And maybe you get a kiss. If she doesn't spit in your face. Uh, uh, wow. Oh my god. What, what, was, what was wrong with you and strong crazy women? Damn it. What's wrong with you? I got a type. Don't judge me. You can't kink shame me. Considering what you humans will watch and what you will do to yourselves, it's hard not to, but I don't blame you for being human. It's just that you guys are into some weird shit. Why do I feel like I just got called out shit? Why do I feel like I just called my damn self? Fuck. Uh oh. Mm. So, she's a bad blood. Yeah. Who's on her? Who's a uh, enjoy her bounty? Pretty much her clan. They're in clan leader. No, oh, wait, 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 wait a minute, what? Yeah, no one really sees her as much, that much of a threat. It's, yeah, she just honored herself by up and dipping after not accepting the clan leader role. It's just... Wait, no. Clan leader, you said he's still the clan leader? How? Well... He decided not to stand down. Or, you know, he decided to still be the clan leader. Oh my god. No. Yeah. 
So, he and the clan is dedicating themselves to finding her and... So, I might as well just finish him off. <laughs> Granted, all of all things she could have done, she should have killed him, but then again, letting him live is more of a fuck you than anything else. You're right about that. I mean, being beaten and bested in battle is one thing. You know, getting killed, that's an honor. That's at least you died fighting, but to get dogged like that when everything was in your favor and just being able to live like that? I can imagine the level of disrespect. So yeah, she she kind of if you know, all I can say is the nerve of this woman. We are clans after her, kind of. If anything else, they get hold of her. Yeah, she's gonna yeah, probably dog him again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I wouldn't say that. that. That's not nice. If anything, the clan should be a bunch of bad blood for how they got dishonored. No, you don't get it. If anything, the clan leader should have uh, should have just stepped down. If anything, he's more of a bad blood for me. <sighs> Her just wanted to leave after, you know, that's understandable, but it's the fact that she didn't leave anyone as a leader or anything on top of that. Seriously. But I do wonder what she's doing or who, who she might be hunting. Maybe she's after some other alien. True, but you gotta think, she's a sadistic woman, she loves hunting in such a way where it messes with her psyche, it warps their mind, it makes it so she's the only thing they think about, can you imagine? So one being that deranged after you. She could. Well, thanks for the talk, Scarface. I have a lot to think about. I feel like I'm I have uh, some plans to come up with. Very well. See you later. You slipping. Stop all that clicking. You gonna kill me or not? You're not even being fun about this, are you? Come on. You can be just a little scared. Please. It depends. Which of us is gonna fall? Me or you? I love that confidence. It'll make it so much more worth it to break you.